Hey guys, it's Adriana and welcome back to another vlog. So it is that time of the month. It's time to go grocery shopping. And today I'm going to be going to Walmart, Sam's Club, and the commissary. So three different places today. It is currently 10.56. So we're kind of getting a little late start to the day. I had an errand that I had to run this morning. There's a cooking video that I need to make for my homework assignment. And then I have a quiz. So I'm trying to get everything done today. Today is Thursday and I like to just go into the weekend with no homework. So yeah, also, um, check out my hair care line. I used my um, Hydrating Curl Cream this morning. It's like one of my favorite hair creams. And my hair is just, it's giving life. It's giving soft, it's giving bouncy, it's giving curly, it's giving healthy. It's, gi it's just, it's wonderful right now. Um, I'm having a really good hair day today. I definitely go check that out. I have the links down below. In my last vlog, if you guys checked it out, <laughs> Red, if you are watching this video, which you probably are, you were cracking me up when you commented, who are you trying to convince, us or yourself, that you, to try to justify you going out to eat? I was cracking up at that comment because like, I really was trying to justify why it was okay for me to go out to eat that day. <laughs> but um, no, like I really did save money. Like I'm being for real. <laughs> but um, yeah, so let's go ahead and head to Sam's Club first. I could go to the commissary first. I could go to the commissary first, but like I said, I'm really hungry. So we're gonna go to um, Sam's Club first. And I know if I go to the commissary first, um, I'm gonna buy a bunch of stuff that I like don't need. So just because I'm hungry. So we're not, I'm not even gonna set myself up like that. I'm just not even gonna do it. I'm not gonna do it. But yeah, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And if you're watching this video, I'm not posting vlogs over here. So um, there may be one more vlog that I'm gonna post because me and Drew just booked um, something for Brock's birthday. And um, I do wanna post it on this channel. I may end up posting it on both my channels, but I do have a vlog channel, so you guys aren't really gonna see any vlogs over here. Um, I'm trying to grow my other channel. I'm at 170 subscribers as of today. And can we get me to like 200? Can we get myself to 200 by the end of the week? I really would appreciate it. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm trying to get that channel monetized before the end of the year. And um, yeah, I have some, there's gonna, there's gonna be a lot of new things on that channel. That's why, that's why I created a brand new channel because it's not gonna be my, it's not gonna be all the content that I've been posting for the past like five years. So it's gonna be some different stuff. That's why I created that new channel. My vlog's gonna go over there. And um, yeah, so I am just blabbing now. So I will see you guys at Sam's Club. I'm about to stop at the gas station right now. All right, I, this was not on my list of things to get, but I'm not gonna pass this up. This almost looks like Wendy's like the chicken nuggets and they are on sale for $10.98 for instant savings. So I'm gonna go ahead and get these. Chicken nuggets was on my list, but I was just gonna get the small bag from the commissary, but I'll just go ahead and get that. Ooh, the sausage has an instant savings. Save a dollar, so I'm gonna get out of here. I had bacon on my list, but look at that price. That was $10 like a couple months ago. I'm, I'm not gonna get it, because $15 is just a, it's crazy. I'm gonna get two of these sausages. I'll just have to meal prep. Um, just sausage, um, muffins, and burritos. I do need this Mexican style cheese and it's $6.82 and I know it comes with like two bags, two one pound bags, so that's good. All right, so I got milk and eggs. The eggs actually didn't come in like a two pack. You had to buy them separate and they were like $4 a pack, so. I got two of those and then 2% milk. I need to cross it off my list. Strawberries are $7.82. That's a little too expensive for me. I can get them for like a few dollars cheaper at the, actually should I just go? Yeah, I'm gonna, get, I'm gonna wait to get them at the commissary. All right, I will grab some grapes though for $5.98. Right, tortillas for taco night and for burritos. Everybody likes this bread, so I'm gonna get this bread again. This is 518. 
and then English muffins for three eighty two. Oh, that one's falling out. Get a different one. I'm gonna get this mac and cheese for five twelve because there's a meal that I want to make, and I don't feel like making my own mac and cheese. And I can season that up and make it really good. So I'm just gonna go ahead and get that for Sunday dinner. And I am done. There's a couple things I didn't get, but like uh, bacon and strawberries, I'm gonna get at the commissary. These mini cinnamon rolls would be perfect for like a quick breakfast for before school. And they are 8.48. I'm not gonna get them today though, but let me know if y'all tried those because I may end up getting those next time or coming back and trying those. I almost forgot Kool-Aid jammers for $7.98. This is all the important stuff. So I walked over by the sushi, but I didn't see any that I liked. Well, I saw the one that I liked, but it was mixed with some other stuff I don't really care for, so I didn't get it. Um, if I see in the commissary, I'll just get the small one for like six bucks, rather than paying $13 for a large variety of um, California rolls that I really don't care for. So I am gonna go ahead and check out. I just didn't really see anything in the snacks that I wanted to get today, so. I'll just have to look at the snacks in the commissary and see what they have in there. So let's go ahead and check out and then I'm gonna grab me some pizza and eat in the car. 86.18. Alrighty, so I spent $86 at Sam's Club, which was actually really good considering I got a lot of stuff and I was expecting to spend at least 100. So to spend 86 was very, I was very proud of myself. Um, I did get a cherry Coke like I always get and I got the pepperoni pizza combo and a churro. And I love having lunch at Sam's Club because it's only $3. <laughs> so um, here's my pepperoni pizza. Looks delicious. I'm gonna try not to get this grease on my clothes. So after here, I have to go to Walmart. I'm actually, I'm not gonna go to the Walmart that's right across the street right here. I'm gonna go to the Walmart that's by my house because I have a pickup order that I need to get. I ordered the Drew Barrymore. Um, it was the crock pot and the air fryer. So I got some new appliances. It was on sale at that Walmart. And when I noticed it was on sale, cause I was just, I was just shopping around, looking online, like literally looking at random stuff. Had nothing better to do yesterday. And I saw it was on sale. And I was so lazy and I didn't want to go anywhere. So I just placed the order and I did it for pickup. And I knew I wasn't going to go leave the house yesterday because I just didn't feel like it. So I went ahead and just picked it up. Well, I'm going to go ahead and pick it up today. So um, that's what I'm going to do. Got me some red pepper. It was Like that stuff was on sale and I really didn't want to pass it up. So I went ahead and just ordered it. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and pick that up today. And then I still, need, I still want to get a toaster of hers. There is the... Um, what else is the toaster coffee maker i think that was it now in the air fryer because you guys know my favorite color is purple in the air the air fryer they had it in a lavender color and a couple of her other appliances they had in lavender but the only reason why i didn't get it i just got the white and gold one was because the crock pot did not come in a lavender color or else i would have got everything in the lavender color color but I just went ahead and got the white and gold. It looks super classy and really pretty. And um, every time I shop at Walmart and I go past that stuff, I'm like, oh, this stuff is so expensive and it's so nice. But I decided to treat myself to a little something, something. So that's what I did. Mm. I'm so glad that I came to Sam's Club first. I would have had no self-control in the commissary. I was so hungry. Okay, there is one thing I just remember that I need to write down on my Walmart list. So from Walmart, I just have the pickup. I need the chipotle peppers in, in the can and the adobo sauce. I need ravioli, red beans for red beans and rice because I have not made that in a long time. And I also need paper plates. Oh, don't get on my clothes. Okay, paper plates. So, commissary doesn't have a good variety of paper plates, but Walmart does. They're more expensive than Sam's Club. Um, so, I'm just going to go ahead to Walmart. 
and get a pack of paper plates there. So I'm gonna go ahead and eat my finish eating my food. Let me take a bite of my churro though. All right, I'll catch you guys at Walmart. All right, I got 200 plates for $12. And then I couldn't find the bag. Well, they are out of the bag of kid red kidney beans. Well, the red beans, they only had red kidney beans. So I got these in the can. I got two of these. Hopefully the red beans and rice taste the same. And then I got the chipotles and adobo sauce. And then if you haven't tried this chicken noodle soup at Walmart, it is so good. So I got two of these. There's like one more thing. I need ravioli and then I'm out of here. Remember I tried these in Chicago? Which one did I like? I think I liked the spicy beef. Emily hated that one. Chicken teriyaki was okay. Chinese style barbecue pork. Hmm, I'm gonna try it. All right, so I just checked in for pickup and I'll leave my phone there. I need to put some of this stuff up in the front so they can put my crock pot and air fryer in the back. My can of red beans fell out and I think I'm missing a can. I don't know where it rolled. I think it may have rolled somewhere. <laughs> Goodness gracious. Is it underneath my seat? I don't know. It may be underneath the seat or it may be rolling around outside somewhere. I don't know. We'll figure it out later, but all right. I made some room in the back. I'm so tired, but I still have to go to the commissary and then do a haul when I get home and it's already 1240. I'm probably not gonna finish all of this until like two o'clock. And I have to work tonight. That homework assignment, I'ma just be real. It might have to just wait till tomorrow because I, I don't know if I'll have the energy to even do that. Well, actually, no, I have to do it because I have to make the meal today. Well, I can make it tomorrow. We'll see, we'll see. I can film the video, it's for speech. I gotta film myself cooking and I chose to do spaghetti. <laughs> so I have to like do a speech, a video, step by step on how to make spaghetti. And that was what's on the dinner on the menu for dinner tonight. So I'm probably gonna end up having to do that anyway. Alright, y'all. I'll catch y'all at the commissary. Um, I'm way too tired right now. Let me go ahead and just relax for a second. <laughs> All right, the produce is all done. I'm gonna go ahead and finish grocery shopping and then I'll catch you guys back at the house. Okay, I have everything laid out. This took so long because I got so much stuff this time and I did go over budget by $30. So I did end up spending roughly around 380. So before I show you the groceries, I wanna show you my Drew Barrymore um, crock pot and air fryer. So these were both on sale. I think the air fryer was $40 or maybe it was a crock pot that was $40 and then one of them was $69 and I just couldn't pass it up. So look how beautiful it is. I love the elegance of it and it just looks so nice. So yeah, I went ahead and got a new crock pot because I broke the lining this to my old crock pot. So I needed a new crock pot anyway and then I just couldn't pass up the air fryer because it was just really cute. So I'm gonna try to get this whole collection. I know for a fact I want the toaster and the coffee maker. I may not get anything else from this collection, but um, I definitely will just have those four items for sure. But now let's get on to the groceries because I'm ready to, <laughs> I'm ready to sit down. It is now 2.02. So I'm gonna try to speed this up and try to relax before the kids come home from school. So over here from Sam's Club, so this whole section right here is Sam's Club. I got some English muffins. I'm gonna meal prep um, breakfast sandwiches again. 
And then I got this bread. I bought this last week and Drew and the kids said they really like this bread. So I'm going to start getting this until they want to switch back to the um, Sara Lee Artisano. We have some grapes right here that will not last, probably past this weekend. And then some Kool-Aid jammers right here for the kids. Two, eight, uh, actually I think this is 24 pack. Yeah, 24 packs, so two 24 packs of eggs. And then, cause I'm gonna make breakfast sandwiches and um, burritos. So I needed extra, extra eggs. And then um, Sam's Club went up on their bacon. It went from $9 to $15 and I was not having it. So I just ended up getting two packs of the um, sausage and I love the maple sausage, but since I was already in Sam's Club and I saw that this was on sale, I went ahead and just got the regular um, sausage for that and then right here we have some tortillas we're gonna need these tortillas for breakfast sandwiches and uh, taco night and then we have some 2% milk back here I saw these Tyson spicy chicken nuggets they kind of reminded me of Wendy's spicy chicken nuggets so I went ahead and just got the chicken nuggets from uh, Sam's Club I think the kids will really like that and it was on sale we got um, one pack of water, some mac and cheese. I'm actually going to season this mac and cheese up because if you add this mac and cheese just by itself, it's pretty plain. But if you add some seasoning to it and some extra stuff and spice it up a little bit, it can be really good. So that's what I'm gonna do for Sunday dinner. I'm making um, hot honey chicken wings with cabbage and mac and cheese. And then we have some Mexican style cheese. I went ahead and just got only the Mexican style cheese. I did have the shredded cheddar cheese on there for the burritos but I decided not to do that because I didn't want to pay extra money for a different kind of cheese so the burritos are just going to have Mexican style cheese and you're not going to know the difference and that was everything from Sam's Club and next we have Walmart I got two of the chicken noodle soups these are so good um I had these one time and I've been going back to Walmart and just buying them all the time now they're really good um ravioli the kids and Drew prefer this ravioli over the one that I've been buying at the commissary. So we're just going to go back to this. And then I got the Chipotle. Why is it not focusing? Chipotle peppers um, for meal prepping. The honey Chipotle chicken tacos. And then I got these Wow Bao buns. I'm going to have the kids try these. And then some small red beans because they didn't have a bag of beans at... Um, Walmart they were out and then the let me tell y'all how mad I am about these plates I go to the commissary and outside of the commissary they have just like a bunch of drinks and toiletries and all of that paper plates just outside I guess they were on sale and you kind of just like grab that as you're walking into the store so it was outside they have paper plates the hefty ones that I can never ever find ever since the pandemic they just disappeared so the hefty plates were sitting outside. There was like maybe a hundred packs of them for four dollars for a pack of a hundred and thirty. There were there was like a hundred packs outside of these paper plates, and I'm like, are you serious? I spent twelve dollars at Walmart for two hundred, and you're telling me I could have got two hundred and sixty paper plates for eight dollars? Oh yeah, y'all, I was hot. Okay, <laughs> I was hot after that. I was like, wow. But can't go back now because I already got the plates. But anyway, spent twelve dollars at Walmart on uh, two hundred paper plates. So we're not gonna talk about it anymore because I don't. I don't even want to think about it. And I think that was everything at Walmart that was. And guess how much that came up to, y'all? Thirty-seven dollars. Thirty-seven dollars. Where do you see thirty-seven? Anyway, commissary. Let's let's go on to the commissary. Walmart is the reason why I went over budget. Now over here, I have some watermelon. This watermelon was looking really good, so I had to get it right up at the front. Some taco seasoning for taco night. Actually, I don't even know if we're gonna need this because I'm making two different kinds of tacos this week and we may not even need this. Uh, well, I'm making two different types of tacos for uh, meal prep. Chicken fry seasoning because I'm gonna make some chicken patties. Everyone loved when I did that, except I got this, I had the spicy ones last time but I can just add some seasoning to this to make it a little spicy. 
Um, we have some gala apples right here, cabbage for Sunday dinner. I needed more honey because I'm making the honey chipotle chicken tacos and hot honey chicken wings. So I needed more honey. Um, hamburger buns for burger night and for chicken patty night. I should have got two packs, but I can always go back to the store. Applesauce for the kids. We have this bottom round roast for birria tacos. I'm finally going to make those next week. I have not made them in so, so long, but I'm like craving them, so I need them. Celery for cooking, and then we have some tomato sauce and tomato paste for cooking as well. One can of green beans for dinner night. And then I did get two, two jars of Alfredo sauce. I don't know where the other one is. Oh, there it is. Two jars of Alfredo sauce for Alfredo night. I'm actually making a fajita style chicken Alfredo. And then I got, instead of just making all that rice in those separate pans, I was like, that was that was too much for me. So I just got these two, um, Spanish style rice and brown and red rice. So I'm just gonna heat these up and pour those into a bowl. Call it a day, make it simple. Two different flavors of rice, chicken garlic and chicken flavor. I like to mix these two together. Um, then we have some yellow rice for uh, one of the taco nights. Chicken broth for cooking. I think this chicken broth is for tortellini and red beans and rice. Or maybe it's just, actually it's just for tortellini because red beans and rice, I can use water. And I think I still have chicken broth in the, in the pantry. Bowtie pasta for the Alfredo night. Pineapple, I'm gonna cut this up in a few days and um, mix it with some other fruits that I have. We have some strawberries over here, jalapenos to put on tacos. And then we have some limes for the um, honey chipotle chicken tacos. Cucumbers for the uh, chicken bowl and rice and quinoa meal prep that I do. Bananas and then these clementines. Did I say cilantro? I don't know if I did, and we have some lemons down there for the dressing for the bowls that I like to make, or for lemon water. And then I have some pizza rolls back here for lunch for the kids on the weekend, and then these um, beef patties for lazy dinner night because, yeah, your girl is working a lot and going to school, and I'm tired. I don't like to cook a big meal every single night, so we don't eat out for dinner as often, there may be maybe twice a month, once or twice a month, we'll actually go out and grab like Taco Bell or order pizza or go to McDonald's. Like we'll get something quick, but it's not that often. Usually we're, we're cooking something quick like this at the house. So onions right here and then some lettuce for not really sure why I got this lettuce, but there's a reason why. I don't know. Maybe for sandwiches, maybe for burgers, maybe for chicken sandwiches, that type of stuff. All purpose lettuce. <laughs> and then um, garlic and then a red onion. I actually need this garlic, the whole garlic, to put inside of the broth while the birria tacos are cooking. Add some really good flavor. And then the red onion is for um, the rice and quinoa chicken bowls that I like to meal prep. And we got some rainbow peppers for the fajita pasta. Um, I went ahead and got these tortillas for birria tacos, switching it up a little bit. So yeah, we got these tacos for birria. And then over here I have some butter, which was a last minute decision because I just realized we didn't have any butter. And then some, we're going back to our Hillshire Farm lunch meat. And right here we have breadsticks. And I'm the only person in the house who likes garlic bread, so I get to have this whole box to myself. Carrots for cooking, many, many meals, tortellini, birria tacos, um, an array of other things, just like the celery. We, it's all purpose. Um, Alfredo sauce, like I said, um, cantaloupe. I'm going to cut this up with some strawberries and the pineapple. And maybe one of the kids' watermelon. Um, we'll mix all that up and have like a little fruit fruit bowl for them for like a quick snack. Um, I got the really big Prego flavor with meat this time because half of it is going to be used for spaghetti. The other half is going to be used for ravioli. And then Big Drew's cinnamon applesauce. We were completely out of barbecue sauce for a long time. We just found out the other night and we needed it. And we're like, wait a minute, wait a minute. We don't have barbecue? <laughs> so I remembered to get it this time. And then we needed some more 
laundry detergent, and then the kids' favorite pizza is DiGiorno three meat croissant crust. They love the croissant crust. They love the croissant and the thin crust. So I kind of go back and forth. And then back here we have some toilet paper, paper towels. I didn't show you guys what was back here. Thick spaghetti. Um, we have the frosted cookies and cream pop tarts, s'mores pop tarts, and the strawberry pop tarts. And then baby Drew's mac and cheese. All right, that was everything that I picked up from the store. Now putting this stuff away is about to be a hassle, but I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. And if you did, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to go check out my vlog channel, Adriana Anye, and go subscribe to that as well. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe because we love it over here and I'll see you all in my next one.